Getting a syllabus into a Blackboard course is one of the first tasks an instructor typically does. There are different ways of getting a syllabus into Blackboard. One, you can upload it. Or two, you can create it using the Blackboard syllabus template. In this case, we are going to use the syllabus template uh, to build uh, our course syllabus. To begin, you need to go into the course where you want to build the syllabus and select that particular course. Ensure that the edit mode is turned on in the upper right hand corner. Go to where you want to add that syllabus. In this case I'm going to put it in the content folder and select that folder. From the options available what I want to do is I want to build content and select syllabus. Give the syllabus a name. I am going to keep it very simple and call it syllabus. And then I have a choice. Create a new syllabus or use an existing file. In this case we want to create a new syllabus and select submit. Now once in uh, the basics of your syllabus, you have a number of headings and body parts that you want to fill out. So I have my syllabus open. I am going to select the first section, which is course information. I am going to copy that, return to my course, and I'm going to change that heading and, and paste that in. Next, I am going to grab that portion of the course syllabus that I want to use and again I'm gonna just paste it in the body. Now you have to be a, a little concerned about the the format but um, formatting that can be handled differently. Uh, you can uh, control all of that. Let's go add the second part so I'm gonna scroll down and select faculty information for my particular syllabus and your syllabus will vary accordingly. So we'll take all that information and we're just going to put it in body two and then finally we get to the third part and so I'm going to take course goals and objectives and I am going to put it into that third part and select maybe through it through this section and add that. Moving down the page you can check the syllabus style, decide what kind, how you want it to look, Do you want a classic, modern, contemporary. You're going to have to experiment with these to decide you know which works best for you. I'm just going to leave as document image. Build lessons. I'm not going to mess with that. I'm going to just leave it as do not create. That can be an entirely different video. And then the standard options. Being able to permit users to view the content? Yes. Um, I plan to let them view it as soon as I create it. And then also track number of views. I, I'm interested in who is viewing it and how often. So I will check that. Um, I am going to leave it open so therefore I'm not putting any restrictions on it. And when done I click on submit. And select OK. So once I select OK, one of the options that I have available to me is, is adding a textbook. So I can add partner content. And so I'm going to search for a textbook. I can search by ISBN number, the title, author, or subject. I happen to have the title. So let me find my textbook and see if we can find this particular one.
and we're going to basically look for wherever it may be and select go. So the theory and practice of online learning by Terry Anderson, that is the one that we are looking for. Uh, it's an ebook. I do know that you can get it digitally for free, but in this case we are going to select that. And once again, I can add additional descriptions. Uh, but more importantly, whether it's required or recommended, I'm going to require it. If there's a URL for that particular book, and in this case it is, let me select that information. And I'm going to pop that in there. And also our normal options to permit, to track number of users. In this case, I'm going to select yes. Select date and time restrictions. None for this. And submit. You have an option to submit and add another if you wish to add another book. But I only have one that I want to add, so I'm going to select submit. And so now um, we have that partner content for that particular syllabus. And that is the, the information on how to create a syllabus using Blackboard syllabus template.